The pensioners of Chevron of Nigeria, Pencon, has alleged that Chevron Limited Company is planning to transfer pensioners' money unilaterally from internal closed pension account to an outside pension fund administrator without agreement. Speaking at a press conference organized by the body of retirees in Lagos, President of Pencon, Omari John Nathan, demanded that Chevron stop outsourcing to a third party until an agreement is reached. He added that Chevron must comply with Nigeria's constitution constitutional laws and respects the interest and choice of its retired staff. We were their most valuable assets just a few years ago. But today, as retirees, we are now seen as liabilities. And when they were coming in, they promised us they would take care of us both in service and, and when in retirement. Today, what we are seeing and witnessing is a different thing entirely. Chevron has not worked her talk. Chevron, as a matter of urgency and importance, must comply with the Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. And Chevron's operational tenants number seven and number 10, by engaging personnel of Chevron Nigeria Limited immediately to one, recognize Pen Pencon immediately and start implementation of dues deduction at source. Two, immediately stop everything concerning the CNCPA at sourcing. I want to say that all the government agencies, the regulatory government agencies should wake up from their slumber and do what is right. The country is plundering every day into into, into anarchy, the way I'm looking at it, because the youths are being abandoned. People are frustrated. Pensioners are frustrated, most especially the widows. The widows are so burdened, and that is why the death rates of pensioners are increasing. Recently, we did a reminder on the same issue, accentuating the importance of engaging the association so as to find a lasting solution to the issue under reference. Gentlemen of the press, Chevron did not reply our reminder.